Welcome back, Guardians, to another video, and in this Destiny video, I messed that up, let's start that again. Welcome back, Guardians, to another Destiny video, and in today's Destiny video, we are going to be looking at Flawless Vigil Ornaments, I believe they're called, right here, Flawless Vigil Ornament, yes, so you get these from going Flawless to the Lighthouse in Trials of Osiris, and they're used specifically to change the ornaments on your Trials armor that you get throughout you know rise of iron dlc you can still get the old taker king stuff which has no ornaments on but the new stuff for rise of iron has ornaments on and so far i have only got the class items so first and foremost i am in my no no hood disabled i've got the hood disabled i don't want things popping up on my hood stop it get off so this is my um heroic strike setup for my hunter Obviously, I need the Celestial Nighthawk to do major damage to the boss. I use the new Trials Auto Rifle, and I have the Gatterhorn and such things to use also because this is a legendary weapon and not an exotic weapon. So anyway, let's get into what this cloak looks like. As you can see right here, it looks kind of badass on it this way. I like it this way better than the actual ornament version, but I'm going to use my Flawless Vigil Ornament on this chest chest on this cloak so that you guys can see it happening so you could just go over here takes one flawless vigil ornaments and five silver dust let's do it boom oh, look at it look at it shining and glowing and hologrammy let's have a look at what it looks like in the tower or at least in the iron iron temple i should say oh my god it looks amazing when you're running around and it's flowing around behind you we oh you can't see it when you're in the snow it looks pretty damn amazing. I'm happy that I've done this. It's, it cut. It kind of goes with the banner on Broken Shader. You know, like, kind of a little bit. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys the flawless visual ornament and the things that you can do with it. Obviously, with the I, be I believe it's the helmet and the chest piece. You need two flawless visual ornaments. So it's a bit of a steep curve to be able to get these ornaments for your trials armors because of the simple fact that not getting like getting to the lighthouse is not guaranteed you get absolutely destroyed by people and destroyed by lag and such things like that i actually got carried by a dude who is just absolutely incredible at trials and another friend of mine who's really good too i'm not bad myself but you know trying to run it over and over again and just getting demolished it's, it's kind of disheartening so i'm happy to at least have this one flawless vigil ornament for my hunter now that my hunter is my main I really do love the fact that I can have this. I'm not a big fan of the Iron Lord um, ornament with the shade. I usually I wear my exotic boots, but for the heroic setup, I need the Celestial Nighthawk. So let's just take that off for a second and have a look. I mean, I think mean, that's a little bit better. That's a little bit of a better look for my female hunter. No HUD disabled. Nobody likes you. Get off the screen. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and you get to see what the Flawless Vigil Ornaments are, how you get them through Charles of Osiris Lighthouse Chest, and what you could do with them and what they look like. It looks super cool. Tell me what you think down below in the comment section, what you think about this cloak. If you've gone Flawless in the Lighthouse, let me know what you've got out of the chest. Did you happen to get one of these Flawless Vigil Ornaments? On a note, I also got this Vision Stone Adept. Um, auto rifle you're gonna see a video about that later probably it has a built-in perk of snapshot it's a pretty awesome auto rifle i haven't quite used it in pvp yet and that's going to be the video later it's going to be a live commentary using this weapon in pvp to see how good or not good that it is so hit the like button guys if you wish to it helps out my channel immensely and we're going to aim for a like goal of just 500 likes you know nothing nothing too amazing i just wanted to show you this guys and see what you think of it so yeah thank you for watching i've been easy now and you guys have been awesome